Hello friends, welcome to my channel, my Sri Parag Dambulkar. In this video, we will see how to run test cases at package level. Now see, in previous videos, we have seen, we have distributed our test cases among the different classes. For example, program 1 has some test cases, program 2 has some test cases, program 3 has some test cases, and all these classes. See, program 1 was one class, program 2 was one class, program 3 was one class, right? So, all these classes, we have put in one package. So, my test was a package and in that package, we have put all these programs or all these classes. Now, in this video, what we will do, we will put program 3.java in some different package and at package level, we will run. So, see, what we will do, we will add one more package. So, now here is only one package, right? Package name is my test and it is the only package. Now, see, we will add one more package, new package. Uh, will give some name my test to support finish so see we got this package now what we'll do we'll transfer this program 3.java to my test 2 so we'll move it so see just we have to do drag and drop so see select and drag and drop okay click on okay so see program 3.java has transferred it is moved to my test 2 package now see in my test package, we have these two classes and my test 2 has one class, right? One program. Now see, in program 1.java, we have two test cases, admission login and admission broken link. In program 2.java, we have two test cases, placement login and placement broken link. In program 3.java, we have faculty login and faculty broken link test cases, right? Now see, we will add one more XML file. So see, already there is one XML file. So what we will do, we will create one more XML file. So see right click on this copy select copy then select this project right click here and paste now see uh, it is asking whether you want to give name test ng 2.xml so okay no problem so we'll select okay now see we got this another xml file right so see here some i'll remove this okay now see so we have two packages right one package my test and there are there are two classes in package my test and my test 2 there is one class right now see so see previously we have run the test cases at classes level right so that's why we have used this tag classes right and then we have used this tag class and inside that then we are using this tag methods right now see what we'll do we want to run this test case at packages level so see i am removing this now see packages just like we have classes so now we are using tag packages right inside that here we will mention package package name okay so suppose if i give my test so in double quote if i give my test okay so here we have mentioned my test now see we will run this so test ng 2.xml now see all the test cases from this package my test has run right there are four uh, test cases admission broken links admission login placement broken links and placement login so that result we got now see suppose uh, we want to run test cases from the package my test 2 so see this will change the name my test 2 now we'll run it So see, here in my test 2 package, there is only one class and in that class, there are two test cases. So that's why we got result like this. See, so there are only two test cases and that result we got. So in this way, we can run test cases at packages level in test ng. So friends, I hope you like this video. If it is then click on like, subscribe to this channel and don't forget to press bell icon so that you will get notification of my next video. So stay connected. Thank you.